All right, I have a rule of thumb. If you're looking for VSTs, I recommend buying controllers instead of going out and buying these VSTs outright, okay? The reason is because these controllers come with a lot of sounds and I think it's a better bang for your buck. Like I got this Novation, Novation Launch Key 25. Uh, this is the, I think it's the Mark III. This thing, I paid $100 for this thing uh, and it comes with so much software. If you wanna get a good VST, especially a piano, it's gonna cost you like 150 alone. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys what this thing comes with. So we got the box right here, right? It comes with Ableton Live Like, you know, uh, Serato sample, Splice Sounds, two month membership with that, that's crazy. Spitfire Audio Labs, Expressive Strings. Yo, these strings are crazy. I'm not gonna be reviewing them in this video, but this thing is fire. Uh, it comes with addictive keys. So uh, when you get, and it comes with three more things, but let's get to addictive keys. That's what I want to talk about. Um, addictive keys, is it new? But it's new for me. When you get this, you know, it comes with uh, the ability or the function to choose between which version of addictive keys that you want. You have Modern Upright, you have Studio Grand, you have the Mark One Rhodes, and the Electric Grand. So these are the ones that um, come with this. I chose the Modern Upright. I don't have a good upright or enough uprights in my collection. I think you can purchase this software outright, but once again, I recommend getting a controller. If you're looking for a good piano sound, I recommend getting the Novation Launch Key 88 version. The link is in the description. And if you use that affiliate link, a little bit of that money comes back to me and help me fund the channel at no extra cost to you. All right, it's Christmas time. Let's play some Christmas music. You get the point. So one thing I like about this software is the amount of control that you have. You can control the sustain pedal, noise, you know, that's typical. Probably can't hear it, but yeah, it's, it's there. Like you can control the pedal noise. That's awesome. You know, want that real piano experience. You can control the softness. Uh, you got the pitch. You can control the, uh, all the typical stuff. One thing I really like is the microphone choices. <laughs> that's that's cool. Uh, and or whatever that ambient two mic or something like that. The SM69 two. Oh man. Front tube. Back tube. So yeah, as you can see, you have these different mic options was will give it a, a different tone. That's that's awesome. You got the noise. Get real crazy. <laughs> ah, what am I playing? All right, that's OD. Yeah, you got the tremolo.
<laughs> That's cool. Got the EQ, chorus. That's that's cool. If you're looking for a quick, easy, you know, to use, uh, great sounding piano VST, instead of buying the plugins outright, get you a controller. Get you the 88 key version of this. I'm actually using the M Audio Hammer 88. But any 88 key controller, um, well, more specifically this one, because this comes with the great software, um, and just get you addictive keys, man. <laughs> it sounds great to me. All right, so let me know what you guys think of this software in the comments below. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you soon. Peace out.